What is up YouTube? How is it hanging today? We got about 10 more freebies for you today. I know that's what everybody wants to hear about is those freebies. So we're going to start adding a part one, two, three, four to this series to make sure that you haven't already watched the same damn thing. So be sure of that. Okay guys, I'll add a different number in there. That way you know which part you have watched. So let's go ahead and dive right into these. Another one that we always looking for, speed intensifier. I know you just probably already scoped out that my animations were kicking it a little bit faster than normal. That's why. Speed intensifier is back in the game, guys. And as you can see right there, it is working fluidly, and I've got it pumped up right there. I don't have it on infinite, but I do have it cranked way, way up there. Another cool one we like here is called Status Bar Timer. Here you can have your timers, your stopwatches, and all that sort of stuff in the status bar. And I'll turn one on and show you what I mean. Just keep looking at the status bar. When I start this timer, look what happens. Absolutely nothing. So as you can see, that it's clear that I have a conflict here, guys. And, and don't, don't knock the developer because... I loaded this thing up with a big bunch of tweaks before I started this video. These tweaks do work. I have been using them. Uh, and we'll come back to that just in a second. But one more here. I was going to share Dizzy Folders. Right here you can enable it and you can turn the animation on for different animations for your folders. When you open your folders up, I have that set to, to turn on to Zoom. But this tweak here may be some of the culprit because I have had a few issues since I have put this one in. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause the video and we'll come right back. Okay guys, another awesome tweak here is one called Power Down. What this does, it lets you turn your device off and gives you the option to respring, reboot, re uh, uh, slide to safe mode, or power off just you got four options now for power down that's another cool way to respring you know a while ago we were talking about we didn't really have ways to respring developers are really coming on strong now taking care of that and another cool one I saw earlier is a way now <clears throat> you can even uh, supercharge your device by installing one that I took let me show you what it's called here one here is called clean notifications 10 and what this does is it sort of cleans up the notifications it says it, it unifies the blur across each notification on the notification center uh, so let's go ahead and pull that down and as you can see here each of the notifications is sort of the same now the blur effect anyway clean notifications 10 that's another free one ready for iOS 10 Alright guys, it looks like the culprit was Clean Notifications 10 that was con conflicting with some of the others. You see up there on my status bar now, the uh, one that was called Status Bar Timer. Uh, I think that's what it was called. It puts the timer in the status bar. Uh, anyway, we'll get the name of it here just as soon as the city load up, loads up. Uh, it was called something, yeah, Status Bar Timer. And you can see up there now, we got the timer counting down. Pretty cool little tweak, guys. Definitely one worth checking out. But now, just because that one conflict, it doesn't mean that's a bad tweak. It just means I have one installed on here that it wasn't getting along well with. I mean, I wasn't having any crashes. It just wasn't letting my status bar timer display correctly. Just wanted to update you on that. What we're looking at, guys, is called Faster Charging. Now, this one will let you charge your device faster. And it has some settings you can configure under the settings menu. Flip down here to faster charging. And in here you says it enables disable. So we're just, we'll just say thanks. And we're going to turn on a faster charger and always save power. And enable faster animation. So this looks like you can turn your anim, uh, animation speed up with this tweak also. So I'm not going to turn that on because I have speed intensifier install and it may conflict with that another cool one guys is called app percent now what this one does is it actually will tell you how much percentage is downloaded when you're downloading an app and i'm just going to open up the app store just to give you an example here 
and we'll and we'll install the first thing that that pops up here uh, and we don't have to buy it of course and I'll just hit get right here don't have any idea what it is but anyway whenever it comes up you'll see as it downloads that it actually shows the percentage now right here uh, and you see there's no percentage shown uh, so maybe we don't have something enabled or something app percent and of course it's not uh, turned on I mean that's sort of device notification when an app download is finished so if you want a device notification you could flip that on let's see if this requires a respring and I'm sure it will and we still don't have an app percentage what the fuck is this about now guys come on tell me tell me tell me uh, maybe we have something conflicting I don't know what the fuck's going on anyway that's what it says it's supposed to do we'll go back in city here and I'll show you on the installed ones app percent right here when it loads up uh, it says the app store installation in percentage and device notification when an app download is finished configure under the settings option and right there's what it's supposed to look like so I am not stupid it was supposed to show a uh, percentage but some reason it didn't want to to uh, go along with us today and the next one we're looking at here guys is called switcher plus and you can see what it does you can add some rounded corners to your notifications here and you just go into your settings menu flip down to switch plus right here switcher plus and you can see you can enable round corner card corners you can intensify how much roundness you want you can disable app icon name and icon which I've you know been known to do that before uh, that saves some keeping people knowing who's texting you and things like that you can disable back background blur uh, and disable home screen card blur so and respring from here so that's Kyle switcher plus guys there's about 10 awesome free ones this time hope you enjoyed the video please if you aren't a subscriber hit that subscribe bucket uh, button I'm working hard for you I'm trying my best to earn your your subscription and as always keep coming back